What's up everyone, this is All I Talk is Tech, and today I'm going to be talking about some new features we're going to be seeing in iOS 13 that have basically just been confirmed. And on top of that, I'm going to be talking about some new features you're going to be seeing on iOS 12, including Circle Apps. Now, so without further ado, let's get started. So the long-awaited feature, Night Mode, is expected to arrive in iOS 13. Now, this has been confirmed by Bloomberg. They're basically a pretty reliable source whenever it comes to Apple news. They're pretty up-to-date on everything. And on their site, they say Apple's next operating system, iOS 13, will include a dark mode option for easier nighttime viewing. Now, what's great about this is that on iOS 12, Apple pretty much gave us a crap night mode. It's not really that good. I'm sure you guys know the whole deal with Smart Invert. But basically, Apple's going to be fixing that. They're going to be having a consistent night mode with consistent colors and things like that. So this will be the year of night mode. So I'm so excited for this feature. I can't wait for it to arrive on iOS 13. So let's move on to the next big news. So if you guys did not know, there's a Twitter user, Altichadev. I really don't know how to pronounce that. I'm sorry if I butchered your name. But basically, they stated that they were going to clean this up tomorrow after school. And then they had this tweet embedded inside of it. So it says, super messy Torngat build running on iOS 12.1.1. Now, I don't know if you guys know this, but there have been rumors going around that there has been an exploit found for iOS 12.1. 1.2 i believe it was and lower so that basically means that you're going to be able to jailbreak your ios device within the next couple of weeks or so if the developers are able to find a way to make this exploit work and on top of that they're going to find a way to make the jailbreak work on pretty much any ios 12 device that is on those versions of ios so what's great about this is whenever there is an exploit and a jailbreak i typically have noticed that apps like files uh, starts to work on ios apps like houdini started to form and torngat is no exception so if you guys do not know i think it's torngat or torngate i don't know how people pronounce it but basically this is an application that will allow you to customize the shape of your apps the folder labels you can remove app labels and things like that i believe you can even remove the dock if i'm not mistaken but you can can change notification badge color you can make them transparent and there are so many cool visual tweaks that you can get now what's great about this is you do not have to be jailbroken for all this to work but you do have to be on one of the jailbroken ios softwares so it's kind of weird you have to prepare as if it were a jailbreak but you are not jailbreaking I your ios device it is just running off of an exploit through iOS 12. So long story short, within the next couple of weeks, I recommend you guys stay on the lowest version of iOS possible. I'll have the versions on the screen that you should be on. Do not update to the latest version of iOS if you want to be able to customize your iPhone within the upcoming weeks. So that is about it for today. Just some quick news. Thank you so much for watching and as always, peace.